And all right guys, welcome back to another video on the David Hammond YouTube channel. In this one, we are speaking of how to transmutate sexual energy or your sexual energy. Now, I know this may sound a little alarming or a little woo-woo or esoteric. Um, it's not, it's very basic stuff. And I'm kind of, you know, assuming, or I mean, you have, quite a few of you guys have come from the NoFap videos. And if you've watched those, then this video you need, like this is essential, this is part of the game piece. If you don't have this, I would be so bold to say that you're going to fail no fat because this is half the equation, sexual transmutation, okay? So let's explain what it is in a nutshell and then how to transmutate it in simple three steps, okay? So essentially guys, um, what sexual transmutation is in a nutshell is utilizing the newfound energy you have acquired from no fat, which is, if you don't know what no fat is, I've made other videos, but it's refraining from PMO, which is porn masturbation and orgasm. So you as a man or a male, you now have all this increased testosterone and life force energy inside of you because you are not just wasting wasting it. And your semen, guys, you need to understand your, your semen uh, carries extremely vital nutrients, amino acids, vitamins, minerals, uh, proteins, like it's... <laughs> It's energy, okay? So by you refraining from continuously ejaculating, you're now going to have this buildup or this influx of potent male energy. Now, um, what was I saying? Sexual transmutation is merely the act of utilizing this newfound energy and transmutating it to, or essentially uh, delivering it to other endeavors, okay? So that's what it is. Now let's explain how to do it in three simple steps. So number one, guys, the first thing you need to do when doing sexual transmutation with this new energy is to first acknowledge it. Okay, you have to, have to, have to, have to, have to acknowledge it. Regardless if you're doing classic mode or hard mode or no fap, if you're refraining from continuously just busting nuts, when the urge comes, when the buildup, the flux comes, you're gonna have to acknowledge that it's there. And if you don't acknowledge that it's there, then you're probably gonna be unconscious and then, you know, you, 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 can, you can fill in the blank. So acknowledge, holy crap, okay, I feel super energetic. I feel this energy inside me. I can see that maybe my old habit cycle would want to do X or Y. I can see that it's there. Okay, you're not putting a blind eye to it. You're not ignoring it. You have to be aware. To, to transmutate anything, you have to first be aware like, okay, here's the uh, the potion, here's it is, or here's what it is, now we're gonna move to step two. So we've acknowledged it. Okay, I'm feeling pretty horny, I'm feeling this, I'm feeling that, I have the energy. Number two is to now embrace it. Okay, so we know it's there, and it's now to embrace. And what I mean by embrace is simply to actually, uh, more or less this may sound a little esoteric, but it's to utilize it, okay? Before we deliver it, we first have to embrace and utilize it. This essentially is, we have the energy, instead of it just lying down, you know, down where the genitals are, like just kind of hanging around, we want to embrace this, we want to actually use this energy. So what I do, it's kind of like a mental cue, is um, before we get to the mental cue, you want to start breathing, okay? Breathing, and this is like any emotion. If this sounds a little silly or woo-woo to you guys, with any emotion in clinical psychology, this is a known fact. What do they get you to do when you feel some sort of anger or sadness or resentment? They ask you to breathe, okay? Breathing circulates emotions throughout your entire body, okay? It allows your body to process things, right? This is usually what happens when we, when we, when we can't process things, we stop breathing. Right when we're so afraid or, or or so angry, it's we're usually not breathing deeply. Okay, we're very like there's these quick uh, little panic breaths, right? So, breathe. This is what I mean by embrace it. Start breathing. Feel it throughout your entire body. Feel this new energy, whether that's the testosterone, the the life force energy, whatever it is to you. It's gonna feel a little different to us. Breathe. Utilize it. What I like to do myself is I picture a diaphragm or a diagram of the energy shooting up my spine and to my fingertips. Okay, this may be kind of a mental thing. We all have our own associations, but for me, what helps me is when I feel it, I, I breathe it, and I pretend it's like a like a balloon. Like I breathe it up throughout my entire body. I feel it up in my stomach and then my chest. And then as a mental cue, I try to bring it to feel like power in my fingertips. Okay, and that's because when you do something, you usually you're using your hands. Okay, so now we've got to step two. So first we acknowledge, okay, it's there. Two, I'm embracing it or using it. I'm bringing it up, I'm feeling it, it's in my body, it's in my fingertips. I feel like I'm so powerful, I can do whatever I want now, okay? This is, again, with any emotion, right? No fap is just one emotion, but or, uh, uh, the energy associated with no fap is just like one emotion like all others. Uh, very basic stuff. Number three, this is now to divert it or to transmutate the energy, to successfully transmutate the energy. Um, if you got to step two, you're 90% there, okay? You've essentially taken the energy out from a 
dormant, stagnant spot. You float it through your body. Now just use it. And this is where the fun happens. This is the fun part because you can use it however you want. You know, if you're into sports, then use this energy. This is why I say bring it to your fingertips. Maybe you play, I don't know, basketball, or you play hockey, then, then, then use it. Like literally and figuratively use this energy. Have that extra burst, that angst. This is a huge, huge, like if any of this sounds a little silly to you guys, then please do your own research. This is a very common idea in sports, in MMA, and tons of physical football, and tons of physical sports. They've documented and asked, we've done interviews with the fighters. Tons of them don't fap. I mean, even if you guys know Logan Paul, this sounds kind of silly, but we all know him. Like he part, you know, he did this as well. Like this is a very basic thing. They won't fap or, or, or ejaculate for weeks to even months prior from a fight to feel this extra aggression, to use this inborn inherent aggression. Okay. So they choose to use it for fighting. Maybe use it for football, maybe use it for hockey. Um, but it can be whatever it is. You don't have to be into sports. Like I'm not crazy into sports. Maybe for myself, I'll use it for working out. I will use it for, um, videos, you know, I'll create videos. Maybe I'll have better work sessions, you know, uh, better study sessions. Maybe I'll want to use it. If you're a social butterfly, you're going to Go like essentially what NoFap is for, guys, is to refrain from PMO, to find a mate or a girlfriend, or to enhance your life. Go out places, have amazing conversations. You know, back when I was really deep in hard mode, like we're talking like like 60, 70 days in, like just intense. I would, as a release, uh, a way to set, uh, transmute the energy, whether consciously or unconsciously, I, I would. I would I would talk to people and I would have amazing conversations, not just blatant, dumb conversations, but with good friends or good people, or even people I didn't know, just have very uh, fulfilling conversations with people. That's how I would transmutate my energy. We all have different ways of doing it. For you, it may be more physical, like sports or hockey or whatever it is. It may be a bit more linguistic. You may like to talk. You just may like to work. It, it's going to be different, but that is the cycle of transmutating sexual energy. It's first acknowledging it. You feel it like any other emotion. You feel that it's there. You can't ignore it right? For anything to pass or to flow, you can't ignore it because then it's, it's stagnant. It's dormant. It's like if you like fart in a room and you close it. <laughs> I know it sounds funny, but like that's essentially what it is. To acknowledge it, you have to be like, okay, someone farted in the room. Let's open the door. Let's allow it to flow. Phase two is to, to use it, to embrace it. It's to allow this energy to actually move, right? It's like allowing the fart to leave the room. And then phase three is to uh, disseminate it. It's now instead of getting mad at the person who farted in the room, you saying, hey, don't do that next time. Okay. Of course I'm being silly here, but you guys understand, um, using it is now the fun part. Okay. This is, if you want to use it in a conversation or sports or this, uh, that is what NoFap is. And anyone who uh, claims to feel benefits of like, I have so much more energy and I'm so much more productive in essence, they've just done sexual, uh, transmutation. That's, that's essentially what it is. It's a very basic idea. It's been documented throughout all history. Like, uh, you know, you do it, if you're a man, you're doing this, whether you, you think, like, if you're a man, the funny part is, is like, all men, once you hit puberty, and even a bit before puberty, we all do sexual transmutation, you can just, it's just a fancy word, you can call it whatever you want, but you're using your boyish energy to assert yourself, that's essentially what it is, sexual transmutation is just being aware of that, and ramping it up even more, so you can get more benefits, okay, so that is it, guys, I hope that was a resource to you, if you watched any of the NoFap videos, this is for you, if you haven't, go check out the other videos on the channel, get yourself saddled in, my name is David Hammond. If you guys are new here, I've been doing NoFap for about a year and a half straight now, and uh, it's it's a lifestyle, okay? And I, I this is a this is a self development channel, and one of the topics we speak on this channel is NoFap, okay? It's not just a NoFap channel; it's a self development channel. There's so many more things in life than just talking about not beating your dick, as you guys know, but uh, it is a, a vital part that can help you. So that's that. I'm ranting. There's always self-development coaching down below, guys, at www, I always say two Ws, www.selfdeveloped.com or the end screen after on the video. And uh, yeah, I'd love to talk to you guys on a more personal level. Check out the Instagrams, everything down below, and we will speak then. Thanks, guys. Keep crushing it. Ask any questions if, you, if you're if you confused. I'd love to answer it. Talk soon. Peace.